I remember a few years ago when I was in an accelerator for business owners and this lady in the class said that she had to put her payroll on a credit card. And I was like, oh my God, like how did you mismanage your company to the point where you had to do that? I was so arrogant. I was so fucking arrogant. And these last few months, I legit almost lost the company. I literally almost lost the company. January, February, March, April have been the hardest four months ever, 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 ever in the history of my life. Like these four months have been just as stressful as when I had a brain tumor when we were stationed overseas. And my sister, my former mother-in-law, and I had really good friends around me during that time to support me. This I had to figure out on my own. One of these days I'm going to talk about like what I had to do to pull the company from the brink. Like we, it was teetering on the edge. Some of the issue was the people that I had hired to help me. Just we didn't vibe. It's my wish. Hold on. I thought my windshield was cracked. It's not cracked. Anyway, um, the people around me weren't performing up to the level that I needed them to. And then I got sick for like the month of January. And when I came back in February, we had to do Good Morning America. And that like sucks the life right out of the team. And then we headed into March. And then it was terrible. It was terrible. Um, so I have employees, I have contracts and I remember, um, going to see a friend during this time cause I just felt like I needed to get away. And, uh, he was complaining about, I don't know, paying for his son's college or something like that. And I, and I just looked at him and I said, there are days when I wish I could go back and complain about thousand dollar issues instead of million dollar issues. When I make a bad decision now, it could cost hundreds of thousands of dollars. I'm on the hook for a new building. It's a million plus. Like my bad decisions on this level are way different than my bad decisions as a teacher. One of these days I'm going to talk about it. I'm not ready yet because I still get emotional thinking about the fact that I almost lost everything that I had worked for because I didn't surround myself with the right people.